so it's our first day here in Kabilbog, Lofoten. So the first thing we need to do is to buy something to eat for our breakfast and it's just around 10 to 12 minutes walking from where we are staying. So, so far the weather is amazing and fantastic. Nice weather. See? Okay. Let's go. Okay guys, so now we are approaching, walking towards the coop, which is a grocery shop here in Kabilvog, the only grocery shop. our breakfast um, we are thinking of going to another island today guys and then um, since uh, there's a one boat that leaves about 8 30 and we are not going to make it because right now it's soon 10 o'clock so let's just take it nice and easy today so we'll take the boat that goes 12 30 or 1 30 I'm not sure now anyway we went shopping a little bit I think this would hold for quite some uh, some time we got cornflakes of course my favorite that's cafe and something to fill in our fridge here and some basic stuff milk pizza if we're hungry and fruits butter yes okay and <laughs> here is our view guys that's our view through through our window to our window is that correct and look how messy here <laughs> we got our suitcases there we got no other place to put it so because we are staying in a little cabin but that's good enough for us too anyway we'll see where uh, we ended up today this is really interesting and um, we did not uh, sleep that much because it was too much light last night and we went to bed around 1 a.m. guys and it was still light outside yes long summer nights so it's really quiet guys <laughs> look we have a bird okay that's uh, my update for today <laughs> so we'll see you again in a few hours bye bye it is really quiet here guys and we are going to take a walk towards that lighthouse over there where is it there there's a lighthouse there a small lighthouse so we are going to take a walk through that path there <clears throat> and get an overview picture and a video of Kabel Vog. It's really quiet. So far all the cabins here are full and we have the <laughs> the smallest one. We have the smallest one guys and uh, this cab these cabins are uh, full of history guys because before this are um, used by the fishermen because uh, there were lots of fish here on season before and then they the government uh, built this for them so they have a place for to stay that's why it's really um, basic 
it's really basic guys but we have all what we need we don't need any other extra uh, facilities so yeah it's really good I like it it's cute you see there <laughs> Okay, so yeah, that is the proper Kavelbog, the centrum. Hmm. So uh, we might not just take the boat today, guys. We are thinking of just taking it easy on our first day here. But anyway, uh, the day is not over yet, so we will see. are now in Henningsvar and even though the weather is like this but then it's cold when the wind blows but if like now we are walking in between the houses it's okay but if you're in the open space oh it's cold luckily I got my jacket on with me
they dry fish here in Lufoten. And these are codfish. Right. Dried. And the temperature and climate there is perfect for dried the fish. Yes. So um, this one, uh, they hang it here just for decoration. <laughs> but uh, we passed a good one uh, on our way here in Henningsvar. And those are fish heads, that, right? Yeah, fish heads, the one fish we saw. Too, and, yes. also and also this one. So this is, you should try guys. I've tried uh, dried codfish and it's very good. You should try it when you visit here in Lufoten or somewhere here in Norway. been walking and we've been uh, wasting so much energy so now I am hungry and I am looking forward to eat my favorite fish soup so you should try it too when you are here in Norway because their fish soup is really good so I think we are going to eat here at Fiske Krogen going to eat okay guys so we changed our mind because there's so much people there so we are going to find somewhere else because even though um, it's uh, the restriction is loosening up here in Norway guys it's still good to have distance from us. <laughs> 